My name is Steve. Welcome to my shop. I'm over by my Atlas 10 inch lathe and I'm going to show you just a trick, if you will, or a hack to make it a little easier to service the lathe. I recently had one of my viewers send me an email and ask me a question as to whether he could do this on his lathe. And it's actually something that I had planned and I bought all the materials to do it and never did it. So let's bring you in a little closer and let me give you an idea of what I'm going to do. Most all of the Atlas lathes, whether it's the 6 inch or the 9, 10, whatever it is, they have this intermediate shaft and it has bronze bushings in it that are greased. And you have these grease caps and you fill the grease cap up and to service the lathe you just take and every once in a while you take and screw the grease cap in and it forces a little bit more grease into the bearing. And my thought on it was to drill this and put a grease fitting in it so that I could just hit it with the grease gun every once in a while. I even went as far as to buy the grease gun and the grease fittings. So let me show you how I did it. First thing I'm going to do is take off the grease cap. I can run the lathe without it on there. It's not a problem. Okay, I'm going to take it over and clean it up a little bit and then I'll bring you back. Okay, I've got the cap all cleaned up. I'm just going to take and put it in the chuck just lightly. I don't want to crush it. Now I'm going to drill it for a quarter 28 thread which is what the uh, grease fitting is. I'm going to spot it with a center drill and I'm going to drill it with a number three drill which is the tap drill size for quarter 28. Okay, there's not a whole lot of thickness to that, so I'm just going to run my quarter 28 tap in there, and then we'll install the fitting. Got my lathe set pretty slow, so I'm going to uh, just <laughs> it's said it's very thin, so I'm just going to power tap it. I don't think I have to worry about breaking anything. Here's the fitting, quarter 28 grease fitting, grease zerk. I'll just thread that in there. 
and snug it up. All right, let's put it on the lathe. Okay, let's thread that on there. Just snug it up. Hook up my grease gun. Fill it up. Now it won't come off. <laughs> there we go. So let me do the other side and we'll finish it up. Okay, it's all ready. I'm going to put some grease in it. A few pumps. Okay, it's actually that shaft is threaded, is hollow. It's actually starting to come out the other side around the bushings. Let me. Put it on this side, give it a few pumps, that'll do it. Every couple of times you use a lathe, you give it a pump or two, and you're set. Well, I hope that was helpful. It's a simple little lathe hack. It took about 10 minutes total, it took me more time to turn the camera on and off than it did to actually do the project. And now when I go to use the lathe, I just pick up my grease gun, which is laying right here behind the lathe, put a pump or two in there, and my intermediate shaft will stay greased. Hope this was helpful. I'll see you in the next video.